since my last video but um nonetheless i appreciate all the love even in my absence i really really do um shout out to tasha you know who hit me up in my dm on instagram and pretty much even without knowing she really encouraged me to like get back on here and like do more videos and everything and i promise you and i know i have said this before but i'll make a promise I cross my fingers and I guess that means that I really don't promise, but I really do um, promise you guys that I'm going to definitely be more up on uploading more content and doing more videos. Nonetheless, um, life has really happened to me and one thing that we really need to work on as people, not just as women, no, more so as women, is that we need to forgive ourselves. Even for things that we don't even need to, like, it's not even our fault. You know what I'm saying? Like, a lot of you have asked me, like, what was going on with my TTC journey and how come I didn't update you guys on my TTC journey. Honestly, I was not in a good place to do so. Um, so I did, like, two, maybe three cycles of Clomid, low dose, what's that, like, 50 milligrams? And I did, like, two more cycles of, like, low dose Clomid um with avadryl and then i maybe did like two or three more cycles of medium dose clomid avadryl and iui which is different than ivf because it's like they take you know your dude's friends and they put them in like this little sterilization thing and then they make them all sterile and clean and happy and then they put them in like this tube like situation and they stick them inside of your vagina and let them meet like at your uterus so that they don't have to swim that far in order to get to the eggs that are there i also at the time had my eggs monitored um every single cycle and by cycle i mean from the first day of my period to the last to like you know when my period went off all the way up until like you know when my period would come back on again like the third day of my cycle i'm sitting on the table still bleeding still bleeding which is disgusting um you know for them to look and see how many eggs dropped and formed or whatever and how many follicles are going to form into eggs and what's possibly going to happen at one point in time they told us from the way that everything was going that it's a possibility that we can have twins and are we ready for that and that's one thing that you can expect from all that stuff is you know multiple births one thing that you may not expect from it that you may not know the realization of is that you will go through a period where you feel like you've lost yourself you know because it's on your mind constantly no matter how much you are like a stress-free person a carefree person it's going to be on your mind that it's happening and your body notices that you're stressed before you do you know so with that being said i mean i put my body through absolute hell and i had to stop nonetheless without that being said we did not conceive which i'm not upset about really i mean at one point in time i was but to be honest i know that i'm not the only one who experienced doing all those things and did not get pregnant like i have a friend who was taking clomid and she did not get pregnant at all. And then all of a sudden, even without taking the clue, without thinking about it, and I guess accepting that it didn't happen yet, she got pregnant and decided to go through labor. To, to She decided that she was going to go in labor when I was visiting her. The audacity scared my whole life. Scared my whole life. You ever notice that when somebody is going through something, you know, with their situation down here that you feel like you're going through that same situation because it feels like you can feel it i don't know maybe that's just me but huh i mean really scared my life but you know what you know it's cool like it's, it's really well with me like i'm i'm good honestly um and i did not really realize how much you know some of you really appreciate you know the videos that i put out with the information that i put out um and just 
it, it takes a lot to get on here and actually be real with you guys and share with you what I'm going through because it, it really, really does. Like, it really takes a lot out of you. Um, but I, luckily, I'm in a good place to do that now. But, you know, some people, for some people that can't, you know, I am here to try to be that voice or to be, you know, that hand sticking out in the dark saying, hey, you know, let me help you. Let me pull you through it because I've been there. So I know what it's like. So, you know, don't be discouraged, you know, if you're looking for it to be a possibility of this is your answer, you know, also think about it, the possibility that it just might not happen. Um, it's just like gambling. It, you know, it's a possibility that you can win and it's also a possibility that you can lose and you have to be able to say when you're going to walk away from the table and say, it's okay, because at some point in time, I'm going to get my happiness. I'm going to get what I came for at some point in time and maybe this is not the answer. Nonetheless, I hope that you guys like this video. I hope that for those of you that hit me up in my inbox, um, in my DM, and even on YouTube, um, that had questions about where I was and what's up with my CTC journey, like, girl, you just love us hanging, like, no, I just wasn't in a good space to record this video or record exactly what took place um but now i am and i have so many more videos in store for you guys so i really 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 hope that you guys watch them subscribe them like them love them comment on them and i will see you guys in the next video bye